So the men in blue, light blue, sparkling blue, Nepal, they sparkled when they played against Maldives. Will they sparkle again? And bringing up the rear, Rohit Chan, one of the outstanding young defenders. He's had trials with Chelsea Reserves, with Woking Football Club in London, and he has his eyes set on playing in European football. So Santosh Kumar, there he is, proud moment for this young Indian, his first big international match, the fourth Indian referee on the FIFA panel. It's his first year on the FIFA panel, it's his first big match. And they are off. Nepal playing from left to right. Small in numbers but vociferous in cheering. Their supporters. The right back. Young Bijoy Gurung. He can accelerate. But held on to the ball too long. Snatched away by Pranav Pranatosh Kumar Das. And a lovely long range shot. Again Sahidul to the rescue for Bangladesh. Young Kumar Lindu has a difficult situation now. Playing in place of the regular Bikash Malla in goal, the entire Nepalese team has come back. Even Vijay Guru coming back, free kick. But just like some magic ball, it drifted through all the players. Uh, Nikolai Ilyevsky indicating that a deflection was needed. The premise wondering what can he do next. He's made two changes. Here come Bangladesh, to the far post, this could be trouble. Cleared in the nick of time by Bharat Chan. Now you see why he's such a highly rated defender. Kept his cool just in front of the six yard box and cleared to safety. Jagajit Shrestha gets the better of Mamun Mia, gets the cross in. A Bangladesh player there, just about managed to deflect this shot from Anil Guru. It allows Bangladesh to wrest control of the ball. Bangladesh moving into attack. Nasirul Islam. Fine cross to the far post. This could be trouble. Limbu making an acro acrobatic save. Again found wanting on the far side. Biraj Maharajan, his defensive works. Question marks on that, on the Bangladesh right back. Twice a free header has been allowed to Atikur Rahman Mishu. The Nepal supporters desperately hoping for a goal. The cross comes in. The header and tipped over. Brilliant save. Absolutely brilliant by Sahidul Alam of the Abhani goalkeeper. So we are in the last minute, last 60 seconds. The limping Shrestha. He won't mind that limp if they can get the winning goal. Anil Gurung, can he spill it? Get the magical goal. It's going to be Sagar Thapa, the captain. A lot of pushing going on in the box. Wasted, absolutely wasted, and it's gone in, it's gone in, it's curled. It's curled in, what a finish. It seemed as if it was going wide. The goalkeeper judged it was wide, and then it went in. And the crowd is on their feet, sheer delirium. What a goal, captain's knock by Sagar Thapa. In English, there's a saying, fortune favours the brave. Bangladesh have been brave. Uh, Nepal have been brave and they deserve this lead. What a free kick and that's all over. And Nepal have one and a half foot in the semi-final on four points from two matches with a goal difference in a glow scoring group of plus one. And Bangladesh, the runners up on the verge of elimination. Graham Roberts, a relief on his face, shaking hands with his European coach, Nikolai Ilyevsky. And it's jubilation for Nepal. Wonderful victory. Deserve it on the night. Anil Gurung's misdemeanors will be forgotten. The chocolate-loving Anil Gurung, whose supporters feed him with chocolate and fruit juice when he scores goals. He didn't get any goals today, but this captain marvellous. What a free kick. Let's see this free kick. It seemed as if the ball was going miles out. Now it dips, it curls. 
This is a free kick would have done the best of the Brazilians and Argentinians proud. What a free kick. It's curled into the net and Saidul Alam thinking that it's going wide and moved out of position. Definitely Saidul Alam to blame. If he'd been on the goal line, he could have maybe punched it over. But all of us misjudged it. I don't blame the 22-year-old Saidul Alam.